<laughs> Luckily, Luigi's asleep, and now I can sneak down and get my brownies. <laughs> oh, I want to ride the pony, Mario. Damn it, Mario. Don't wake up, Luigi, or you won't get your brownies. Oh, no. Why is my stomach growling? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Cabbages and greens, broccoli and beans. It's oh, so for good. God's it's sake, really Luigi, really sing talking again. Really <sighs> oh, I don't want to wake Luigi. Well, it kind of does sound like Luigi's already awake. His flipping singing voice sounds like an elephant stomp. <sighs> anyway, I really want those brownies. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I have to take the stairs! <laughs> ah! Here I am, at the legendary fridge! Oh god, I'm always on with my voice. Okay. Oh my god! Look at the chocolatey goodness! Oh my god! Um, audience, just before you continue watching, uh, I just want to say, the eating you're about to see uh, is not very appropriate. And if you have kids around, please make them look away. <laughs> oh, 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 my God, I was on my knees for those brownies. Oh, oh, God, I need to go to bed now. <clears throat> okay, Mario, you did it. You ate all the brownies and no one knew. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go to bed now. Oh, no. I feel this needs to coming on. <laughs> ah, choo! Mario, I'm pissed. You have got to be kidding me. You wake up because of a sneeze. Oh, let me guess, Mario. You snuck in the middle of the night to eat my brownies again. Oh, you fat ass. Luigi, how can I not resist a creamy, chocolatey brownie? Oh, God. It even makes me want to act up even thinking about it. Uh, uh. Uh, Mario, I think you should calm down now. Okay? Um, you know, it's going to be annoying buying brownies uh, again. I've literally spent millions of brownies and I've never actually tasted a brownie in my life because you, every time you just eat them and it's really annoying, Mario. So, I would appreciate it, Mario, if you would stop eating my brownies because it's annoying. Okie dokie. Alright, Mario, because you woke me up, um, me and you should just watch TV now because, um, yeah, I'm not tired. You know, it is very late, like extremely late because it's pitch black out there. So, yes, yeah, let's watch TV. So, Luigi, good old pal, good old governor, what should we watch, old chappy? What about Mario? We watch the best bloody game show ever. Late night with Adam McKay. I hear there's a Halloween episode coming on. How does that make sense? They're releasing a new episode in March. Oh no, Mario, it's not a brand new episode, it's actually an episode that aired in the 70s, but they had to take it down for whatever reason. I don't know to know. I guess it was too scary for audiences. But anyway, Mario, are you ready to watch it? Okay, Luigi, let's do this! Boop. I am your host, Adam McKay, and this episode is very special. It's the Halloween episode! Yeah, you get your bottoms luck, you're cheering, because today is going to be packed. For Act 1, we have kids say the funniest things. And let me tell you, it's going to be funny! And then, for the second act, the most important act of the night, this girl claims that she's been possessed by the devil. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Tyler, you like when I do that, don't you? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready for Act One. Kids say the funniest things. <laughs> Today with me, I have Junior. Hey, what's up, Slime Ski? Huh? What do you mean, Slime Ski? Are you calling me a slime scheme? What is a slime scheme, may I ask? I have no idea. I just always hear my friends say it. It's just really weird. They say loads of weird stuff. Like what, Junior? My friend is always saying that there's noises coming from his parents' room, and we all theorise about it. Like, I think it's just a big, scary monster. But my friend Derek, on the other hand, thinks it's a machine playing noises just to scare him to go to bed. So, um, we do not know. Oh, okay. Uh... Yeah, I think, I, I um... This is a kid show, but I say I think it's, um... Oh, no. I think it's the sand machine thing Derek said. Like, I think your friend Derek is very right about it. Well, because you're an adult, I agree and follow with everything you say. Like with my mum, this mailman came over and she was like... This may be your new daddy. Don't tell Paul. And I was like, okay, I won't tell Paul. And yeah, I, I never told Paul. But um, now that I think about it, those weird noises are coming from my parents' room too. So yeah. God, what is happening? You're right, Junior. You do have to listen to everything an adult says. Like, for example, you guys all know that I used to be a teacher. And I used to be in a private school with a lot of misbehaved children. And you know what they did? They smashed their heads against walls. They swore at us. They called us names. I can't even repeat on this show. But there's one kid. Flipping Frank. Oh, he really drives my gears. Oh, he could have been insulting me every day. So I was like, I'm excluding you. And he didn't like that. He cried and cried and he cried. And he ran around the school smashing his head against stuff. So, me and this other teacher, we cornered him. Flipping Frank. And he tried, he tried to, he tried to get past us. I was like, no, no. So, never insult your parents. Uh, Mr. Adam McKay, sir, have you taken your meds today? No, Junior, I haven't taken my meds. I'm going crazy. Okay. Sorry about that audience, oh my god, oh, I haven't taken my meds, okay, but anyway, let's introduce the new kid, and his name is Cody. How did I never know how crazy Adam McKay was, like, god, he does need to take his meds for god's sake. Yeah, Mario, yeah, 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 anyway. Can we skip this next bit when he talks to his boy Cody? Because I want to see the adverts because, you know, it's 70s adverts and I want to get nostalgic. And then I want to see, like, this kid who apparently gets possessed and that's probably why he's got taken off air. I wonder how Gibby it's going to be. Okay, Luigi, let me just skip. Okay, done. Honey, where were my pants? Honey? Honey? Huh? Oh, wait. I'm recently divorced. Hey, are you recently divorced? Huh? Where's that sound coming from? Go outside and touch some glass and maybe you'll get a gal. Okay, okay, okay. You're telling me, if I want to meet someone, I actually have to go outside. Exactly. Oh, man. Oh, I wish there was a world where I could just date someone. Oh, without even leaving my house. Mm, 2020. God, I wish that was a thing. And go to a special restaurant. Uh, if I go to this special restaurant, I can get a girlfriend. If you want to listen to amazing life advice like this, please pay £7 a day. And then you'll be able to hear more life advice over the phone by our colleagues. Oh my god, Mario. I remember this commercial. He used to be my favourite, Mario. Oh, let me do it. Let me do the line. Let me do the line. Honey, where are my pants? To be honest, Luigi, I did prefer this ad of a, your new favourite ad about cheese. 
Wait, it's Mario. Oh my god, that's my favorite commercial, Mario. Oh my god, I love cheese, Mario. Do you know what? You want to watch it again, Mario? Let's watch it again. Oh, fine. You're the definition of filler. There's no point showing this. It's filler. Mario, I'm going to show it if you or the Indians like it or not. Because I love cheese. I like cheese. You should buy it. Jesus Christ! My God, I didn't even realise how lazy the ad was. I could pick up cheese and eat it and go, I like cheese. But no, that guy gets paid over £100,000 for it. Yeah, well, I guess me and you could make a much better cheese commercial than that. Yes, Luigi, we probably could. But this isn't called CTN Movie, Man Luigi's Cheese Commercial, is it? No! Okay, Mario, you don't have to be mean to me. <laughs> <sighs> guess what, Luigi? Me and you rambled over all the ads. Uh, at least it's like the Act 2, which is a special horror act. And the act we've all been waiting for. So let's watch it. Hello, welcome back to Late Night with Adam McKay. As you see, I'm a lot more calm because I've actually taken my medication. My hair's a bit better because I shampooed it and um, while looking at the previous footage from when I was talking to Junior, my teeth looked a bit yellow, so I decided to brush, brush, brush them. Now, are you ready to communicate with the dead? We have a kid called Patrick, who claims that he was possessed in the night. <sighs> Folks, you, sh you're not, you should not miss this one. This is going to be insane. Hey everybody, it's me, Patrick. And uh, something's, something weird's been happening to me. I think, I think I'm possessed by the Devil. <laughs> so, when I was talking to you behind the scenes, you claimed that you had the devil inside you and that the devil told you to do these horrific things. Like, apparently, you killed your nan with your bicycle. You ran her over until she was a bleeding puddle. So, do you have a name to this devil? Oh, the devil inside me. I call him Mr. Wiggles. And why do you call him Mr. Wiggles? Because he just seems to just wiggle himself in and out of me. Apparently, with your mum's help, you can control him. Mum says we all have a demon inside us, but we can't always control them, can we? That's what you get when you mess with the devil. Someone help me! Please, please help! Oh my god, Mario! We're gonna die! Uh, oh Luigi, are you crazy? It's just meant to scare you. It's not actually saying, Oh, you're gonna die, the devil's gonna get, coming and gonna get you! Ooh. Ooh. Luigi, you're an idiot. Mario, for once in your life, can you not insult me? Like, I remember in primary school, that's all you did was insult everyone. I remember one time, you got sent to another school because no one wanted you with them. Then one time you got added to a call with them and they just insulted you, insulted them and called you the meanest person ever. And you're like, I've changed, I've changed, but clearly you haven't, you little idiot. <laughs> Screw you, Luigi! 
Ah, now he also got possessed by the devil. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs>